Well, tonight's change maker, the woman behind an organization that provides families of people with disabilities information about services and support they can get to help their loved ones. And she does it out of a personal connection to the issue and a desire to see that something like the infamous Willowbrook State School never happens again. Change Makers, brought to you by Adapt Community Network, empowering people through innovative solutions one person at a time. We change. Willowbrook State School was supposed to be a place to help children and adults with intellectual and developmental disabilities. More than 40 years ago, Geraldo Rivera revealed the horrors taking place inside. It was eventually closed in 1987. No one, no one should be treated like that. Animals shouldn't be treated like that. Ellie Roofer is a head of NYC FAIR, Family Advocacy Information Resource. It's an organization that informs family members about services and support for people with intellectual and developmental disabilities. For Ellie, the cause was born of a personal need when she started advocating for her own daughter. Well, I realized I had no idea what was going on and my daughter was aging, needed services and I didn't know how to get them. So I became aware of things that were going on and how the services are delivered and funded and all that. Parent involvement uh, with NYC FAIR right now, is there is there enough parental involvement? We're getting there, um, Zoom helped. NYC Fair was part of a rally commemorating the anniversary of the closing of Willowbrook and urging more state support for people with disabilities. When I look at this and it says, don't, don't take us back to Willowbrook and hashtag Willowbrook never again. What does seeing those words do to you? Uh, just the more they defund the person-centered planning pieces of housing, which is exactly where they're cutting right now, the larger the site will, you know, will be and it will go back into state operated things because they, they will put the providers out of business. NYC Fair has been encouraging family and friends to press state and local politicians with a campaign through social media. What are some of the things that they need? They need to be safe. They, they, you can't cut staffing. You can, they need to be occupied. You can't cut their programs. Well, NYC Fair has a socially distanced rally planned for next month outside of Governor Cuomo's Manhattan office. If you want to learn more about NYC Fair and what they do, you can visit their website or their Facebook page. And of course, if you know a good change maker, I always say it, reach out to me on social media at Tamsin Fidel. Love to hear from you.